Howdy y'all. How y'all doing today? Welcome to another episode of Country Fixing. Today we're fixing to put together a chair my wife got for a baby's room. It's a uh, Adley by Delta Children. It's a poster glider. And it's for her whenever the baby's born to nurse in, rock the baby to sleep, me to rock the baby to sleep, or to feed the baby. What, what need be and all that. And, uh, Today's sponsors is going to be life. It's what led us here. <laughs> Number two, caffeine gets me up for work in the morning. Number three, state of Georgia. It's who takes my money once I go to work. Number four is alcohol. It's what gets me to sleep at night. Other than that, I'll put a link, or not links, I'll put a picture of the box here in the video in just a minute. It should be the thumbnail. And we'll get started. Thank y'all. Bear with me. Well, howdy y'all. This is uh, the Adley Composter Glider Rocker Box. And this is one dog and one cat. And we're going to put this thing together if I can get the animals to let me have it. We're going to get our trusty handy dandy box opener. Oops. Just sharpen this on the concrete in the driveway. Right before that video. We need. like the back to it. Well, this may be easier than what I thought. I thought it was going to be coming in a million pieces. Looks like hardware. Hope y'all can see that. That's the uh, tools it comes with. Allen wrench, a couple washers, and two bolts. And then some handy dandy instructions. There's this red ribbon you can pull. Supposedly makes the box separate, but uh, it ain't worked. protection before returning this product information don't plan on returning it information hope not anyway Dang. it's stuck in the box This one's in the beige color, I think it is. Okay. 
you by yourself and ain't got a lot of strength, I suggest getting somebody to help you. Is it aggravating? Probably do something that didn't need to be done, which is just dump it out. This works good for getting the plastic off. I don't know what these are, but they're broken zip ties. I guess it kept it, the glider or rocker part from turning. Then it's got some more zip ties in here that you got to cut loose. So we're going to get our handy dandy box cutter. Try our best not to hurt ourselves or anybody or anything else. That's the cushion for a seat. And plastic.
one Allen key. It's an M5 Allen key, it says. And then bolts like that you got your bolt with the allen key got your washer slide it over pull it down now this i hope y'all can see this try to do this in the camera this slides up in there Once you get it in there, as far as it'll go without turning, you can put your Allen key in there and start turning. Well, these cats are enjoying this box more than I am, I can tell you that. And you're going to turn clockwise like that to tighten and you're simply just taking the allen key you stick it in with sorry stick it in with this end here you're going to stick that in through the head of the bolt and you're going to turn it like that and that'll tighten it that'll pull the back of the chair down and in it and then let me get this other washer ready. Move the box so that the cats can play elsewhere. <clears throat> and then, okay, look right there is the other bolt hole or the other, yeah, bolt screw hole. I'm gonna take the second one. I'm gonna put up. I'm gonna push it in. As far as it'll push, you can turn it clockwise with your fingers, and then turn it with this. Now, once you get them too tight, or not too tight, once you get it tight enough to where it won't turn anymore like this. You're going to tighten it down instead of going in like this with the Allen key. You're going to put it like this and put that in the head of it and turn it like that, like a wrench. And that'll put the put a little more torque and leverage on it to where you can get it as tight as you need to. To hold the bolt in, well, pretty much just to keep from squeaking as much because it'll, if you don't tighten the bolt down good, it'll squeak when you're rocking. Or I ain't saying this one will, but other rocking chairs I've dealt with throughout time, if you didn't have the bolts tight, they would squeak. And I just tighten it until it's good and finger tight. And uh, if you want to go over to other bolts and washers and all that to make sure they're tight, you can. It's pretty much assembled other than putting those in. Oops, sorry. There and there and sliding it down on them rails. Uh, pretty much assembled other than that. Go back the camera up so y'all can see me uh, flip it up, maybe sit in it, and see how she goes. Move the axe out of the way. Don't need it right now anymore.
And this is the uh, seat cushion that came in the bag. No, really, just protect the plastic stuff. And you don't want to take the tag, fold it under, slide it back. Let me check the camera, make sure that y'all can see the whole chair. There. Looks like y'all can see the chair now. And I don't know what tag that is, but no, that's the one with the chair. But there it is. It's a glider rocker. So that you can sit here with the baby. It's not real wide. We didn't want a big one for the baby's room. Uh, but it is rather comfortable. It swivels pretty good, rocks real good. And if you want to, watch out, baby girl. If you wanted to prop your feet up on a footstool, it sits pretty nice and comfy. But, that is the Delta chair thing that I said earlier. And I'll take a picture of the uh, box and put it as a thumbnail. And yeah, it's the Delta, Delta Children's Upholstered Glider. That's what it looks like, I guess. And then finished product I guess it's more like a cushy hospital chair if you want to say it like that but it's pretty smooth I don't hear any squeaks or uh, rattles or anything I could see me sleeping in be a good nap time than this thought it was gonna be way more uh, way more steps to put it together it's not not bad at all but uh thank y'all for tuning in to country fixing i hope y'all have a great day great week great month great year and maybe this video helps somebody somewhere thank y'all